Hello guys, in this video, I will guide you how to download and install IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate uh, Edition version 2020 with OpenJDK 14 to get started with Java development on Windows operating system. You know, IntelliJ IDEA is an intelligent Java IDE developed by Zetman's company. It is smarter and more powerful than Eclipse and uh, NetBeans and uh, the edition uh, IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate uh, is a commercial uh, edition. It is best for developing a Java web application, Java enterprise application, and Java frameworks. And you can use IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate Edition for free in uh, 30 days. Suppose that you have a fresh computer without any Java programs installed before. So, you will need to download an installer program for IntelliJ IDEA and uh, with the new version of IntelliJ IDEA you don't have to install ZDK separately because IntelliJ IDEA is bundled with the uh, Java runtime environment that means IntelliJ IDEA can run without uh, ZDK install on the computer and then you can download and install ZDK right inside the IDE and after Installation. I will show you how to create a first Java project in IntelliJ IDEA. Now, let's download install a program for IntelliJ IDEA in Chrome browser. Uh, head to zrens.com slash idea slash download. This is a download page for IntelliJ IDEA. And uh, as you can see, there are two editions, uh, Ultimate and uh, Community. Uh, for web and enterprise development with Java, uh, it is recommended to use IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate version. So for Windows, you can download installer program in uh, XZ format. So click the download button here. Uh, IntelliJ uh, IDEA Ultimate edition is the commercial uh, edition which means that you have to pay after the uh, evaluation time which is 30 days and you can see the uh, installer program is being uh, downloaded it is quite big over 640 megabytes You see the download has completed and click the downloaded file to run the installer program for IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate Edition. And this is a setup program for IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate Edition. Click next and uh, choose the default uh, destination folder next and here are some options which you can uh, choose I choose to create a desktop shortcut for 64-bit launch you can also check this option to create an association, association with .java files and click next and install IntelliJ IDEA is heavier than Eclipse and NetBeans, so the installation will be longer, much longer than installation of Eclipse and NetBeans IDEs. Okay, the installation uh, has completed and check this option to run IntelliJ IDEA. Finished. When this dialog appears, um, choose do not import settings. Okay, and this is a nice, very nice splash screen of IntelliJ IDEA. And, uh, 
uh, the first time you run IntelliJ IDEA, it will ask to customize the uh, IDE. Just click skip remaining and set the default. And this is the uh, ultimate edition, so we need to uh, either activate IntelliJ IDEA using a license or uh, evaluate for free. So for the first time, uh, just check this option. Evaluate for free, and you can use uh, IntelliJ IDEA uh, Ultimate Edition for free. In and click uh, Evaluate button here. And this is a welcome dialog of IntelliJ IDEA uh, Ultimate Edition. Mm. Click uh, Create a new project here. And you can see with the ultimate edition, uh, there are um, many uh, options to develop uh, enterprise web application with Spring Framework, the import server, um, Kotlin, Maven, Red Groovy, Android, Java AppX, because the uh, uh, Ultimate uh, Edition is the uh, best version to develop Java Enterprise application. And now, uh, let me show you how to create a very simple Java project. But the first time you run IntelliJ IDEA, you may see a uh, no SDK here. Yeah. So with the new version of IntelliJ IDEA, you can download and install the IDK right inside the IDE. So click this download the IDK. And IntelliJ IDEA recommends to download and uh, install OpenJDK. And the latest version is uh, 14.0.1 here. And the default location for OpenJDK. Click download. So as you can see, uh, IntelliJ IDEA is a smart intelligent IDE. IDE. So using uh, IntelliJ IDEA is uh, very easy and convenient, and many programmers uh, loved IntelliJ IDEA. So we're installing OpenJDK 14 now right inside the IDE. Very convenient, and you can see the project SDK is OpenJDK 14 here. And uh, click next and check this option to create a simple Java project uh, for command line application. Next and enter the project name is yes, my first Java app. And the default package is com.company. Click finish. And this is, this is the workspace of IntelliJ IDEA. And this is a project view. This is a tip of the day dialog. And you can see the source folder package, the class, main class, external libraries is OpenJDK. And let's write some code here. This is a main class in Java. And in this main method, we uh, write statement to print hello world uh, message to the, the standard console output system but uh, not print line hello world IntelliJ idea ultimate edition 2020 that's it very simple and you can run this program by clicking on this play button. Yeah. Run main. You can see the error uh, semicolon expected. Yeah. And click run away.
then in the output you can see it prints hello world intelligence idea ultimate edition 2020 perfect right so that you've learned how to download and install IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate Edition version 2020 with the OpenJDK 14 to get started with Java Enterprise development on Windows operating system. I hope you have found this video helpful. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share. Thank you.